So recently I had the chance to sit down with the band on a Monoguchi and we had a great time shooting a breeze. We must have talked for about two hours. And of course he can't fit all of that into one 15 minute episode. And instead of holding on to these clips and never showing them, I decided to share a select few. And one of these is on Weird Al because as you know me, I, I love Weird Al and I can't help but bring him up in every conversation. And so, of course, Weird Al comes up. And so let's let's find out what the band thinks of Weird Al. That accordion over there is Weird Al's squeeze box. I don't know. It's not a real. It's a it's a box set full of every Weird Al album. That is so sick. Oh, and I'm not I'm not yeah. just flexing, but <laughs> the reason I bring it up is because Weird Al. Was, yeah, I know, right? <laughs> but it's there, right? No, it's amazing. It's uh, you you can pick it up, dude. We we love Weird Al. Oh, anyway. awesome. we are big big Al. Yeah, boys. check it out. It's weighty. Yeah, open it up. Um, How do you open it? Uh, there's a snap yeah. on the top. So you just, you, anyway, the point is, is that uh, really cool, the yeah. really reason I bring it up is because Weird Al never really swore. So like, right, when did. I started this channel, I was like, you know what? I'm going to do that. And it just worked in my favor because now, you know, with the adpocalypse on YouTube, right. like, you know, it's like, wow. I'll, I'll keep it clean in that case. <laughs> you know, I don't care if, if you, that's fine. But what you're a, right. What he, a box. Isn't like, there an well, apocalypse too on there? It's, yeah, it's all of them. It's all of yeah. them, which is crazy because some of them had never been on vinyl before, oh, and they good. haven't since been on vinyl. Like I, I love Weird Al's original songs so much. Oh yeah, yeah. right. Yeah, like yeah. Uh, I remember Larry. That's a great song. I remember Larry's really yeah. good. Uh, the Night Sand Went Crazy is extremely yeah. good. Yeah. Um, Albuquerque. Albuquerque. Yeah. Uh, Pete and I have for a long time been wanting to do a, a very no effects -y cover of Everything You Know Is Wrong. Oh, yeah, that because would be it, really good. I was driving in the fast lane. Like, a, <laughs> yeah. like it doesn't have <laughs> super, <laughs> super fast chord changes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Did, did Jonah Ray get to that before you guys? Did it, Wait, what do you With mean? The, you can't call me Al. <laughs> <laughs> you, haven't, you haven't seen that? No. Oh, no, he has like a, with, I think with some guys from Fiddler, or they had something to do with it. Wait, really? Yeah. Huh. He has a man. Uh, we, like we should just get them over the band. Band. So. You can't call me out. <laughs> wow, that's smart. We should, what are they doing on Friday? <laughs> Playing at the Fonda, baby. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, my uh, Dare to be Stupid. I love oh, that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that song was, that is was great. That album is great. Apparently, Mark Mothersburg was jealous. <laughs> of, of the beat that Al got. That it should, is a really good. Ours. It that is a really good track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like uh, one it of my, sounds amazing. He's always had great production. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, no, like his pastiches are amazing. Like uh, Al's twenty or twenty was it two thousand inch TV of REM? You know, like I haven't heard that one. It's uh, I think it's on Alapalooza. Oh okay. Yeah, that was like that was the year for me. I saw it. I got well the year before. Well, the album before I got no wait was it that. Yeah, it was Al Palooza. It was the first year I saw Al. So we, we've never 94. seen him. Have you seen him? So we've, we've failed to see Weird Al live. I snuck into a concert, into a <laughs> county fair. Nice. To we've talked see about him. it a lot. We have. Uh, it was, it was in what state? Cool. Uh, oh, it was just in California. Okay, cool. It, I don't think it was like a state fair. It was just, he was just playing this, <laughs> this fair. We'll catch him someday. He's, he is a really inspirational dude. Yeah, yeah. He's uh, just so... Precise. Like I, I used to have two. Well, I still actually I still have two, two, two turntables, but I have more than that. Uh, but I used to have like a DJ deck, and so like I would take uh, girls just want to have fun, and then I would get girls just want to have lunch. Mm -hmm. and like, I'd, I'd sync them up <laughs> and like annoy my friends. I'm like, happen? listen, I, I, put the, I put the fader right in the middle. That sounds like a great YouTube channel. That sounds. <laughs> Hard pan. Yeah, yeah, yeah do hard pan would be sick on that. Like, yeah, friends just the 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 like weird <laughs> farty sounds over the synth solo. The little hand. Yeah, the hand <laughs> fart sound. Yeah, the manualist. Oh, man. oh <laughs> I forgot about the manualist. What uh, is that? He's a, a, a YouTube sensation. Oh, okay. Hand, hand farter. That's the <laughs> man manualist. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Check uh, out his trooper. Funny. The trooper cover. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, that's I, yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, a musical hand farter. So <laughs> yeah. I think he, he was on Jimmy Kimmel. I think. Oh yeah. really? He's yeah. famous. Yeah, well, then that's not as good. What's as he doing on Friday? <laughs> <laughs> all right, everybody. That will do it for today. I want to thank you all so much for watching. I am Revile Geek, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Hey, everyone, thanks again for watching this video. Now, if you are interested in checking out the full interview, head over to Patreon with the link right there.